there are three characters I enjoy working with the most, and those are Charlie Brown, Linus, and Snoopy. I think Linus is the most fun to work with because uh, he is the most versatile. I am what my one daughter, Amy, described as she came into my studio one day and asked me something and she said, Dad, you're obsessed. And to me, if I have to describe it in one word, I would say that is it. But I draw comic strips for the same person or the same reason that some people do watercolors or play the piano or do something like that. It, it's the one thing that I think I know how to do. and. Uh, uh, I think I'm proud of being a comic strip artist. I, I think along with jazz, it's the one pure American art yeah. form, although they don't consider us artists, you know. Uh, we're downgraded considerably. We're not considered worthy of art galleries and things, but that's all right. But you feel that you should be um, because it's an American art form. Yeah, because it, it is kind of insulting when you see a huge white canvas with a black streak going through it. And I remember looking at the, um, in, uh, the Metropolitan ones and seeing paintings like that, and I thought, well, maybe what I do isn't so bad after all. But then I went upstairs and I saw the Monets and the Picassos, and I thought, well, maybe what I do isn't so good after all. <laughs> <laughs> That'll do it for you. What do you want your, um, how would you ascertain your legacy? Uh, I don't know if I'll be regarded as, uh, as a great a creator as, the, as Harriman that did Crazy Cat, but I think I have contributed a lot to my profession. I think I have lifted it a little bit. I always used to say that Milt Kniff, who did Steve Canyon, yeah. contributed more to the cartooning profession than any other cartoonist, and that's fine. And I would like to have people think that I have elevated the profession uh, to a certain extent. <laughs>